Bob's here. The slime's coming home. Bon appetit, Ben. We're gonna get through this. And, and don't, don't say we're, we're gonna, gonna get, get through this. this. <laughs> Only now we're in deep space in the 15th century. We, the Holy Legions, proffer up this sacrifice to slake the vile, depraved thirstings of the unspeakable one. Well, let's clear that up. Better dead than Smeg. But can I just say, you are my all-time favorite fascist dictator. <laughs> Wait for me! Mind that bus, what bus splat? You are the most obnoxious, trumped-up, hearty <laughs> little Smeghead. Silence, scum! <laughs> hey, buds, don't do this to me. You can't forget me, I'm unforgettable. They're gone, buddy. Every action we take has trillions of implications. How come you forgot that? No, I didn't forget, sir. I just didn't care. So you come from a, a female orientated society? Thomas Solman. Zap, pow, splat, die in bed, you Trojan pig dog. It's the old backfiring time, gauntlet trick. They are the vermin of the universe. And the all night poker sessions. Is it always strip poker? It depends on how drunk we are. Across that valley lies an army of darkness such as mankind has never seen. The only thing between them and total victory is this pathetic pocket of resistance without a leader, without a plan. And into this bleak arena steps a man. The man for the moment. Who? who? Me. Who'd you think, Pat Boone? Green visor known pages 25 to 59. You will then be tested. If you fail, tomorrow you will do a five-mile jog. I am now returning to you control of your body. <laughs> Outland revenue, sir. Still snowing, is it? We're on the dog's milk. Your brain's smaller than the salad section in a Scottish supermarket. Here we go! Hello! Yeah! Smoke me a kipper. Can you do that? Death is certain. Is this the human value you call friendship? Don't give me the Star Trek crap. It's too early in the morning. I don't know what made us want to come to this hellhole in the first place. I do. Father. Without computers and technology, we reduce the level of primitives. All we've got is us guys. Us and our own resourcefulness. My God, it's worse than I thought. It's podgy. It's not a classic profile. Can I do anything? Is it okay if I breathe? Can I breathe? What does this mean? What does any of this mean? Are there a bunch of arrogant, pompous, emotionally weird, stuck-up megalomaniacs? <laughs> it's gonna be one of those days. <laughs> It'll make you a multi-multi-multi-millionaire. Tests that probe every aspect of your mental capability. Do you know what happens to sausages left unattended for three million years? <laughs> yeah, they go mouldy. Your sausages, Dave, now cover seven-eighths of the Earth's surface. Put it there, buddy. Put it right there. Right, you're on report. We're stuck with you. Now all the corpses that litter that battlefield can just lie there, safe in the knowledge that they snuffed it under a flag of peace and can now happily decompose in a land of freedom. You smeghead. I'm sorry. Get the spacesuits. You guys are two letters short of an allotment. I don't care that you've killed three men. Five. It's fatal. It happens. Doesn't mean we can't be friends. Is this the British Embassy? There's no need for us to be at loggerheads. I mean, we're mates, we're pals. When? <laughs> so America had a president controlled by the Mafia? <laughs> yes, I gave her the old, uh, there's something in your eye technique. <laughs> Fixed her with the mesmer stare. Mm, mm, mm. Last time I saw him, he was redoing my paintwork. Changing it from military grey back to ocean grey. He's quite, quite mad. Smeg, you use me? I'm a free man. Uphill, slight burrow to the left. Don't rise to him. Attack of the giant savage, completely invisible aliens. The man's a maggot. Because the king of the potato people won't let me. Think about it. Everything we've been through. Does none of that mean anything to you? Naturally, I will commit suicide immediately. Haven't you got something in your eye? Rumor death isn't the handicap it used to be in the olden days. It doesn't screw your career up like it used to. We've got to rebuild the human race as quickly as possible. Do you want to start now or do you want to clean your teeth first? Listed to Red Dwarf. We have an odd midst a complete smeg pot. Ignore it! I'm it's a complete 
Santo Nutter! They clearly have a technology way in advance of our own. So the Albanian State Washing Machine Company. My robot goldfish! A creature with the head of a cat who embalmed the dead. Androids! Everybody needs good androids! <laughs> These are Black Frankenstein's hand-me-downs! In just six days, I had created my own world, lush and verdant. Cheers, man, brilliant! I'll give you five. I can do better than that. I can give you 15. So everything that's happened to me, he's gonna think happened to him. It's a mistake any deranged half-witted computer could have made. Humans have always found exact duplicates rather disturbing, sir. The 3000 series was notoriously unpopular. Most of them were recalled. A few slipped the net and went undercover to make new lives in society. Mr. Flibble's very cross. Well, it turned into a sort of splodgy, squelchy thing and squidged off down the corridor. <laughs> Dog attack! Go! Oh. Came up. What do you mean? Just because we're three million years into deep space and the human species is extinct? That means nothing to these people. They'll find us. Stone. Stone. <laughs> 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 They were going to sort that out in the dub. <laughs> Go on, he's probably picked a ring. I'll put it in my diary. 12.30, lunch with God. Is she doing what I think she's doing? Why, what do you think she's doing? Playing pool with planets. <laughs> the way you live in an environment where justice does exist, you have no free will. Die like the dog you are, Miss Trust. There's enough fried calamari out there to feed the whole of Italy. You'll die for this. So here we are, on the stairs. 229 floors above G-Deck. I drank a couple of bottles of cheap red plonk and then one of the guys that tore the Eiffel Tower. I was okay until I got to the top, but then I couldn't keep it in anymore. <laughs> Apparently it landed on Montmartre. <laughs> That's five miles away. <laughs> the story I got told was some pavement artist sold it to a Texan tourist. Told me it was a genuine Jackson Pollock. <laughs> I've just cut me pants. Off! <sighs> and then you said, well, it probably is deja vu. Well, it probably is deja vu, it sounds like. <laughs> is that what I think it is? What do you think it is? An orange whirly thing in space. What the hell's happened to my teeth? <laughs> I was asleep, okay? And the next thing I know, Plastic Percy here put a sponge on my face and out go the lights! Hey guys, look at this! Who the hell are you? I mean, you're a gutless, spineless, gormless, directionless, neurotic, underachieving, sniveling, cowardly pile of smeg. No offense. <laughs> Did you see anything really weird in that mirror? Yes, you, you ugly goit. At least Mr. Lister's guitar survived intact. <laughs> Not even Mr. Lister's guitar survived intact. How dense do you think I am? You really want to know? Just divide your mass by your volume. He's gone. He's really gone. The asshole sacrificed his life to save us. I can't believe he's gone. Okay, I didn't like him. But I like not liking him. Who am I gonna not like now? This <laughs> looks such a hole. If God had intended us to fly, he wouldn't have invented Spanish air traffic control. But don't try and follow me. Otherwise, the body gets it. Snake! Snake! Oh, <laughs> Something tells me you're not really a doctor. What gave it away? The fact that I've gone fully 10 seconds without patronizing you. Expect sickness. This is a ship, Mr. Rimmer, of superhumans. <laughs> Are you my faithful manservant or what? I'm ashamed to be with you, sir. Hang on a minute, what's a mind probe? He's dead, Dave. Everybody is dead. Everybody is dead, Dave. <laughs> so what did go wrong? It's insane. <laughs> Feeds off your negative emotions. Fear, guilt, anger, paranoia. 
drains them out of its prey. Space weevil. Better. That is so much better. I feel good. Where am I? Why do we never meet anyone nice? Why do we never meet anyone who can shoot straight? What's wrong with me? You're totally egocentric. You flee at the first sign of trouble. You only look after number one. You're vain, you're selfish, you're narcissistic, and you're self-obsessed. You just listed all my best features. When I finally get round to write my good psycho guide, this place is going to get raves. Accommodation, excellent. Food, first class. Resident nutter, courteous and considerate. Psycho rating's got to be four and a half chainsaws. We've been cornered by a T-Rex that was formerly a sparrow. That's not chicken, sir. Mm, what is it? It's that man we found. Fasten your belt. Hey, I do not need fashion tips from you. I've been eating half the crew. Would you describe the accused as a friend? No, I'd describe the accused as a git. Something's wrong. Something's different. <laughs> Wait a minute, I never used to be a man. You know how I feel about fresh vegetables? <laughs> the health psychos, vitamin freaks, people who exercise. I don't know how we became you, but I sure as hell don't intend to help you carry on doing what you're doing. <laughs> Open the waste compactor. Uh, what are you doing? Climb inside. No! no. <laughs> this serves no... Engage the mechanism. <laughs> you are sick! Where did you go, Butlins? <laughs> right! <laughs> Rimmer and me, we've had a bit of a tiff. <laughs> Nothing major, but it goes without saying. It was his fault! Be a government informer, betray your family and friends. Fabulous prizes to be won. No chance, you metal bastard. It's not as good as the original. Well, they never really found anyone to replace Hammy Hamster, did they? All right, dudes. The evolutionary process through a life form so much stronger and more deadly than any other species. Damn near wiped out everything on the entire planet. Knight to King Bishop Three, Queen to Rook Eight, checkmate. That's an illegal move. Oh, sorry, queens don't move like that. I was thinking of poker. Look, I'm sick of hearing about these stupid cats! He said it was all right and all that, like, and the shoes were happy and that they'd gone to heaven. You see, it turns out shoes have souls. <laughs> oh, what a sad, sad story. <laughs>